What is a diagnostic session? AppDynamics captures transaction snapshots periodically, as well as whenever it detects performance issues. So let's say you noted a problem and now want to perform deeper investigation. A diagnostic session can help you with that. After watching this video, you'll be able to explain what a diagnostic session is and how it can help your troubleshooting. When triggered, a diagnostic session captures transaction snapshots with a full call graphs over a defined period of time. It can be for single business transactions or multiple ones. Frequency and duration are configurable. Diagnostic sessions can be triggered automatically or manually. Let's first take a look at automatic diagnostic sessions. A diagnostic session is automatically started when a threshold is crossed. By default, this is set to when more than 10% of calls in a minute have errors or are slow, very slow, or stalled. When that happens, a diagnostic session is triggered for the affected business transactions. Let's take a look at the configuration. We are looking at the slow transaction thresholds under Configure. Scroll to the Diagnostic Session setting area. Threshold, Frequency, and Duration can be modified here. A diagnostic session can also be triggered in response to a health rule violation. So, for example, you can create a policy that triggers an action to start a diagnostic session when the business transaction response time is too slow, health rule is violated. We are looking at the Create Action screen under Alert and Respond, and then Actions. Here is an option to trigger a diagnostic session as an action. The steps to set up an action and a policy is discussed in the Actions and Policies video. Along with these automatic settings, there is an option to trigger a diagnostic session on a as-needed basis. Let's say you are investigating a slow transaction, but the slow transaction does not happen often enough to trigger an automatic diagnostic session. In this case, you can start a manual diagnostic session. Let me show you how to do that. We are on the Application Dashboard page under the Transaction Snapshots tab. Go to the Diagnostic Session sub-tab and you will see the button to trigger a manual session. Select one or more business transactions here, and set the frequency and duration here. Right now is set to collect five snapshots a minute for 10 minutes. So when the diagnostic session is done, you should have 50 snapshots. You can also trigger a diagnostic session from the business transaction page. Highlight the business transaction that you want, and choose Start Diagnostic Session from the More Actions drop-down menu. In all cases, collected snapshots appear under Application Dashboard, Transaction Snapshots, Diagnostic Sessions. Let's explain the abnormal error rate set. These are captured because the error rate for this business transaction exceeded the threshold. Now you can explain what diagnostic sessions are, list three different ways to trigger them, and access the snapshots captured as a result.